tough loss tonight to Washington yeah. State. Uh, narrow one one nil loss. Um, what were some thoughts after the night? Thoughts were, uh, you know, obviously great, great way to send out our seniors. In terms of the performance, I know um, the result's not what we want. We know this. Um, but just the, the way we performed, the way we fought for each other, you know, that's all we can ask for. Um, poor, poor choice and poor decision at, in, in the first minute that cost us eventually. And we talk about, we talk about um, coming out and making sure that we start on the right foot and we start correctly. We just, it wasn't about not starting correctly, we just made a poor choice, you know. And look, at the end of the day, the response is what we talk about. And we created a lot of chances and we created a lot of... Uh, energy going towards their goal. Just, just honestly, the ball didn't fall for us tonight. It just wasn't our night, to be honest with you. Um, the team had plenty of chances, as you said. A um, couple shots on goal, 11 shots total. Um, what needed to be done tonight to you know, break through there? Like I just say, sometimes it's just not your night and it just doesn't bounce your way and just hit, we hit the post and, you know, we, uh, we're just sometimes lacking a little bit of composure when we're in the 18-yard box and it just, it just didn't uh, break our, our way in terms of in front of goal, you know? We got we got into the final third well. We got we got into the 18-yard box really well. Uh, and look, to be fair, Washington State is a very organised team, very physical team. They know what they're good at, and they do it really, really well. Um, so they des I mean, they deserve the win because at the end of the day, they defended with their lives too. You know, so credit to them. But uh, for us, sometimes we just got to understand that it's very hard to play from a one-nil deficit, um, and we got to we got to clean up that side of the game. Um, down to the final couple of minutes there in crunch time there. The team did, you know, perform well, you know, on the attack. Uh, Lindsay had a couple of good shots on goal. Uh, just missed one barely on the free kick down here. Um, you know, what are some things, like, you saw from them during that time period where it's, like, you know, could have gotten that equalizer, and especially on that last play of the game where they called the foul in the box? You know, we just got to be a little bit more consistent in how we create chances. I, feel like, I felt like when we had time and space, we were rushing the, with our decisions. Um, Playing one touch, playing early, playing direct when we could have had a obviously chance to bring it down and, and, and connect it to feet. And I thought once we, we played with calm, calmness and composure, we were able to uh, create more chances in that way. Um, but I think, you know, just understanding when, when situations are pressurized, when situations, you know, it becomes towards the last part of the game where, you know, everything gets a bit frantic. Can we add a little bit of calmness and composure to, to create those chances? Honestly, and that's how we got that free kick. Vela took a good touch, bought the free kick, got the foul. Lindsay played the ball in. I, I, still, I think there was a foul there. The referee was saying there was a foul on number 12. Um, but again, great header by Jackie and lovely finish by Ellie. Just unfortunately, it doesn't count. But that's what we need more of, that calmness and composure to create more chances. You wrapped up your, your home slate tonight, um, back on the road um, against LMU and Pepperdine coming up next to finish the season. Uh, what are some thoughts heading to those two games to uh, yeah, wrap up two, the season? Two really good teams. LMU very organized, very uh, very drilled in how they play out of possession. And Pepperdine, we know Pepperdine are ranked nationally, so they're going to bring some different challenges too. But uh, you know, we got pride to play for. we got this badge to play for. we got representing East University in the right way. Um, and then, yeah, two more games to go and a chance to play college soccer in, in two high-level games. So great opportunity for us to get better and keep developing.